Hello everybody and today's blog is where to get fantastic sushi when you're in Branson on vacation. Um, there's a lot of little known uh, restaurants that people aren't very familiar with um, that you could uh, try and you'll never go anywhere again. You'll just think about how wonderful these restaurants are. I've been eating there for many, many years. I've got a top four pick. This is going to be a fast blog. Not going to take up too much of your time. Again, the website we post this to, MelodyLaneBranson.com. Um, hotel that I used to manage. It's the uh, original website, and now we're doing show updates. Where you can get your coupons at when you're in Branson. What restaurants to eat at. You know, what's the total organic experience when you're in good old Branson, Missouri? Uh, pick number one, the Sushi House. It's on Highway 165 across from Walgreens. You head west on 76 until you get up to the 165 light. You take a left. Boom! Sushi House is right there. Um, it's a small uh, family-owned uh, sushi shop. Everything is fresh. I've never gotten a bad piece of sushi there ever. Um, the first thing you want to try when you get there is the spicy tuna is fantastic. You know, it's a, it's just, it's just a basic roll, but there's none of this, you know, baking all these different things around it, and then you find the spicy tuna inside the roll. It's, it's just sticky rice, um, spicy tuna, and the guy makes it for you, you right there. Um, you know, you can see all the ingredients, everything's very fresh, and they make it fast. The second roll you want to try is the spicy salmon. Keep it simple. Um, they've got a lunch special um, where you can buy two items. It's about nine dollars, and I think that goes till about two every day. And um, they serve you miso soup. You could maybe have a salad or a soup um, with the Japanese dressing on it. Um, but it's fantastic. It's my number one pick. Uh, pick number two is Wakayoto. Um, it's on the strip across from the old Jubilee, which they're now remodeling. Um, Walmart as well. Again, you're going to head west on uh, Highway 76. When you get up around the Taco Bell area, look to your right, and you're going to see uh, Wakayoto. Uh, at Wakayoto, you want to stay away from the simple rolls. You want to go towards the a little bit pricier roll because that's where the magic is. Um, there's an Alaskan roll that is fantastic and a Las Vegas roll. That is really good there, but you know they really put their energy in the in the bigger rolls, um, the better rolls. So if you you know you're kind of looking to spend a little bit more on your sushi, um, instead of going there for lunch, you might want to go there for dinner because you are going to spend um, a little bit more. Um, there's also a uh, lunch box or a dinner box that you can get. Gives you a wide variety of things. Oranges, you can do sashimi, you can do the spicy crab, which is a fantastic roll. Um, and the soybeans and all that different stuff, edamame. Um, all that's in the lunch box there. So if you're looking for a lot of food for a pretty good price, you might want to do the dinner box. Or if you're eating there for lunch, you might want to do the lunch box. It's a great location. Not too busy sometimes, so you can get in, you can get out. And, uh, Finally, uh, number three, Branson's best kept secret is a buffet. It's a, uh, a, a place that where they do the walk and everything. It's uh, on the right hand side as you're going uh, up 76. It's uh, kind of like that new hot who hut thing where you can um, put your um, stuff together and then they um, fry it right there in front of you. But they've got a sushi section on the left hand side and they make the sushi fresh right there and if you're just a sushi lover and you're in a hurry uh, this Chinese buffet is a, a fantastic um, place to try out again you're headed west on 76 it's on the right hand side across from uh, an old time photos kind of place and hooked on Branson actually so it's just right across the street and uh, it's right next to El Portel uh, Mexican restaurant which may have changed um, names uh, at this point, but um, um, Four Seasons Inn is right across the street. So, I mean, if you need a, uh, something you can uh, base that on. Sometimes the the place updates its name and changes kind of uh, what kind of oriental food it serves, but it always has the sushi. And um, they've got the, uh, the great sashimi. Uh, their individual rolls are okay, but, you know, if you're just as addicted to sushi as I am, you're always looking for... 
um, a way out. Finally, uh, number four is uh, Shogun's, which is over on 165. They kind of have a nightlife. They kind of have the more of the designer um, uh, sushi that um, you like. And uh, you're going to go again west on Highway 76. When you get up to the 165 light, you're going to take a left. You're going to go through um, your first light. You're going to keep going until you see the Falls uh, Village Mall on the left-hand side. Go in there. You'll see the Shogun signs. A little hard to catch sometimes. Uh, their hours are kind of uh, transient sometimes. That's why they're number four on my list. Um, if you have any questions or anything you want to see uh, posted here, please share this video, like this video, comment on this video, any future blogs you want to see. Uh, I'm here for you. And uh, again, the website, MelodyLaneBranson.com, and I hope everybody is well. And have a fantastic day.